Hello Church! Hello everyone who's watching us right now here at the official page of Lagro United Methodist Church Philippines. Welcome to our segment, Hymns from the Heart. Hello everyone! Yes, here we are going to feature church hymns and sacred songs with the heartwarming stories behind them and the inspiring stories of the men and women who wrote them. So that they may not remain as mere hymns we have learned to sing in church, but as hymns from the heart. This is Tito Arnel. And this is Levi. Join us in this segment. Hymns, hymns from, from the, the Heart. heart. Our feature song for tonight is a very familiar hymn. The lyrics of this hymn are woven in such a concrete manner that even children at the basic level can understand it. Its title is, This is My Father's World. The writer of this hymn was the Reverend Maltby Davenport Babcock, one of the leading Presbyterian ministers during his time. He followed Dr. Van Dyke, author of the hymn, Joyful, Joyful, We Adore Thee, as the minister of Brick Presbyterian Church. Babcock was born in Syracuse, New York, and was a graduate of Syracuse University. He continued his education at Auburn Theological Seminary in New York. It was after serving two congregations at Lockport, near Lake Ontario in Baltimore, that he assumed the pastorate at Brick Presbyterian Church. Pero, nakilala din si Babcock na isang mahusay na amateur musician. Tumutugtog siya ng organ, piano, at violin. Kinilala din siyang isang university sportsman dahil sa kanyang mga achievements sa larong swimming at baseball. Isa din siyang outdoorsman, may malapad na malikat at matipunong pangangatawan. Meron siyang isang tulang, may pamagat na Be Strong na nagpapakita ng kanyang insight at pananaw sa buhay. Sabi niya sa wikang Ingles, We are not here to play, to dream, to drift. We have hard work to do and loads to lift. Shun not the struggle, face it. This God's gift. Paano naman na isulat ni Babcock ang imnong ito? Ayon sa hymnologies na si Kenneth Osbeck, habang nagdilikod bilang pastor si Babcock sa Lockport, New York, malapit sa Lake Ontario, nakahiligan niya yung maglakad-lakad sa umaga papunta sa tuktok ng burol sa gawing hilaga ng bayan kung saan niya makikita ang full view ng Lake Ontario at ang paligid nito. Lagi daw niyang sinasabi sa asawa niya kapag magpapaalam siya, I am going out to see my father's world. At doon nabuo ang mga titik ng imnong ito. Napublish ang himnat ito posthumously in Babcock's Thoughts for Everyday Living noong 1901. Although, sinasabi na maaring sinulat niya ang imnong ito earlier than 1901. Wow! Earlier than 1901. Pero hanggang ngayon, kinakanta pa rin natin ito. Buhay pa rin sa puso ng mga Kristiyano ang katulad na pagkamangha sa dakilang likha ng kapangyarihan ng Diyos. Amen. The original poem was composed in 164 line stanzas, each beginning with This is my father's world. One of Babcock's friend, Franklin Shepard, adapted an English folk song, inserting portions of Babcock's text into three eight-line stanzas. 
The hymn in this form first appeared in the composer's hymnal, Alleluia, a Presbyterian Sunday School book published in 1915. The tune name, Terra Beata, means Blessed Earth in Latin. The first two stanzas are unusually concrete in their reference to nature, rocks and trees, of skies and seas, birds, the morning light, the lily white, rustling grass. For Babcock, nature was not only a visual spectacle, but an oral experience. Nakikinig si Babcock sa tunog ng nature. Perhaps the author's skill as a musician contributed to the many auditory images, like listening ears and nature sings and birds their carols race and rustling grass. According to Dr. Hahn, professor of sacred music at Perkins School of Theology, the music of the spheres, mentioned in the first stanza, is a concept borrowed from Greek philosophy. This is the idea that the most perfect sounds cannot be heard by human ears. They take place in the orderly movements of planets and stars. The actual sounds that we hear on Earth are but a weak imitation. Kaya lang, namatay si Babcock mga ilang buwan bago siya nag-42 sa isang ospital sa Naples, Italy, pagkatapos ng trip sa Holy Land. Medyo bata pa siya nung namatay siya. But well, and so, with no further ado, let's join our hearts together to sing our feature song for tonight, This Is My Father's World. Thank you for joining us tonight. This has been Tito Arnell and Lovey here, and this is 
Hymns from the Heart, a production of the Communications and Web Ministry of Lagre United Methodist Church.